My vision for this Black History Month is definitely value. When you think of value, you think of something that can be broken, something that's priceless. For instance, it could be this dollar. I could ball it up, I could tear it apart, I could throw it down and pick it up and it'll still have its value. This dollar could be battered and bruised and still have its value. Some things we still deal with in the black culture that have battered and bruised us is that graduation rates in schools for black and brown students is about 40 to 60 percent. White people are 50 percent more likely to get called back from job interviews than black people just because of their name. We are also 44 percent more likely to be arrested or have encounters with the police in our lifetime than any other culture. This is just the tip of the iceberg of what we still deal with. Unfortunately, we are living in a world where we are shown these things and given every reason to feel like we don't belong and that we do not matter. But I'm here to tell every black king and queen that we do matter. Without us, there would be no hip hop, no elevators, no stoplights. There wouldn't be even surgical procedures. There wouldn't be certain types of style of clothing. And in grades K through 12, we are conditioned and being told that Thomas Edison single-handedly created the light bulb when in fact Lewis Latimer, a black inventor, created a carbon filter to go in the light to even make it turn on. It's up to us to start loving us and make them love us just as much as they love our culture. My vision for us is to believe that we are limitless and unbreakable no matter what is thrown our way. We have came a long way and we are still continuing to build. So next time you king and queens feel like you can't make it, that you aren't worthy, remember that we have created motion that hasn't been able to be stopped by anyone. So let's get used to demanding more from ourselves, more from society. Let's keep pushing for equality in schools and in the workplace. And let's start thinking of ourselves as a dollar who can't be broken. That we are priceless. That we are more than what they say we are. Our culture and our history is what makes us who we are. We are beautiful and we are worth it.